Hello everyone and thanks for joining us. Golf carts are par for the course on Osseo City streets and now city leaders want to make changes to an ordinance allowing people to operate a motorized cart. Reporter Sonia Goins explains. We have everything that you need right here on Central Avenue. Osseo has a lot of small town charm with big city appeal. Grocery store, a gas station, we have a lot of uh, restaurants. But getting around to popular spots can be a problem if you don't have a vehicle or are unable to drive. Some people get around town in one of these. We have quite a few people that use them because we are a small community. Under state statute, people are not required to have a driver's license to operate a golf cart. But under a proposed ordinance, Osseo wants some form of identification to operate one. The city also wants to make sure drivers are healthy enough to get behind the wheel. It's either a driver's license or a doctor's note just saying you're physically able to drive the machine. Drivers of golf carts are subject to the same traffic laws as other motor vehicles, and operators also have to have insurance. It's different. It's fun. Artis Schmidt is a volunteer driver for the city's golf cart trolley service. I usually pick up about three people a day. She says many middle-aged and elderly folks ride the golf cart. Oh, they like it because they go to the meat store and they can go to the doctor's office. The trolley is free and anyone can hop on. In Osseo, Sonia Goins, CCX News. The Osseo City Council did approve the first reading of the ordinance.